Hello, and welcome to my 13th video introducing my book, Debugging Shakespeare. In my last video, we looked at Dodos, Spurs, John Speed and Sir John Croke. We also looked at Edmund Wright of Nantwich who built almshouses. In this video, we will take a look at bears and variations on the theme of bears. In the famous to be or not to be soliloquy, in Hamlet, the word bear is mentioned three times. We find it referenced in connection with the Great Fire of Nantwich in 1583, where bears were supposed to have been let out by the landlord of the Bear Inn, causing mayhem amongst the townsfolk whilst combating the fire. It is interesting to notice that the word for bear in Latin is ursa, which contains the homophone ewa. If we look at heraldic emblems, the bear and ragged staff emblem was adopted by Robert Dudley, the alleged favourite of Queen Elizabeth. Dudley was Lord of Denby and Chirk in North Wales, just 15 miles from Shocklatch, where John Dodd originated. The supposed motto of Joris Hofnigel, who we met in er an earlier video, was Dumb Extendar, suggesting a meaning of as I grow longer, I bear all the blows. The word bear is embedded in the name of the clergyman, Thomas Beard, who supposedly described Christopher Marlowe's alleged death by stabbing in 1593. Last but not least in this video, we look again at Sir Thomas Flood, whose father was born in St. Martin, Shropshire, who allegedly was born in Bearstead, as was his alleged son, Dr. Robert Flood. Thank you for watching. There will be many more videos like this in the near future. The only way to get a full appreciation of who the Bard really was is to buy my book. It is available only on Shopify. Please scan the QR code shown with your mobile and you will have a direct link to Shopify. Thank you.